Hello Survivors! Welcome back to another video. How are you today guys? Let me know in the comments. Guys, we're back with another reaction video. I think that I'm going to do a bunch of reactions today. I have a little bit of time and we are rushing into the semi-finals from the Reservoir League. And I'm excited to react to these matches because they are so close and they are like super strong alliances fighting each other. So I get excited watching these matches as long as they are like entertaining, okay? Now, I get some comments all the time, you know, when I react to these videos. Well, Mike, why don't you post your videos? Why don't you post how you play? Guys, go back to my YouTube channel, okay? It's as simple as that. I have posted all my history here with State of Survival. You have me playing as a joiner. You have me playing as a rally leader. And you can judge my skills based on those videos, okay? So there's nothing to prove here. I'm reacting based on what I think is going to be the best for the team which wants to win. And of course, I just pointing out the mistakes that I can personally make, you know, we are not perfect. So yeah, leaving that aside, we are going to jump into this. Actually, this is a new player, State 743 versus State 740, 754. So the name of this player, I don't know it yet, but let's get into that, guys. Remember, the only thing that you have to pay attention here in the semifinals is that all these people probably are super strong and there are a lot, they have a lot of troops. So the strategy of like smoking people and trying to find weak targets sometimes doesn't apply that well here at this stage because it's very, very hard to find weak links. Although because this is like a relatively new state, uh, they still have like plasma eight, plasma nine. It might work. You have to test the waters to see what's going on. But if you attack like a multiple players and you find players with like eight million troops, six million troops or they are reinforcing quick, you are wasting your time trying to call one minute rallies or trying to smoke that play and keep hammering or porting around the buildings. You better invest that time in reinforcing your players, ghosting the building that you are trying to take and speeding up to other buildings to fill that. And when the water tanks open, then you want to use those marshes to gather water. OK, so that's what I recommend you in the semi final, especially final of the Reservoir League, because the players who are there, they are strong and they have been playing for a while. And that strategy of the, that's what I want to see. That's what I want to see. That's the all, that's the other key point that you have to understand, guys. In the Reservoir League semi-final, final is just about taking those buildings first. And one more time, you have like top spender, top spender experience, guys, like trying to rush to that building. What's going to save you is like, of course, aside from the monkey, the aircraft, if you have the same battle power, the amount of troops that you are sending. So if you activate Massive March here, it helps you to take first occupation. I also help you to take first occupation in center because you are going to have that Massive March activated. Okay, so I know that I'm ranting about here, but I think this is good because the finals are coming. And if you're watching my videos, so I really want you to apply these advices when you're fighting for the final. Okay, so let's see here. They have P9, P8, P9. I think that this alliance have like less uh, strong players based on HQ, okay? Because they have more P8s and stuff. So quickness, guys. Quickness is super important in this semi-final final. If you are not quick enough, then it's going to be a problem. So, so port here. You want to send troops here, the other building, and then check which one needs reinforcement. Nice, quick, speed up. This guy was quicker, you see? This guy was quicker. Wow, this what this guy was quicker. They were quick. Now, if you lost this, you have this, this, and this to take. So don't lose time. You already sent your march. They they already took the building because this guy sent. This is speeding up. This is speeding up probably. There are still chances that you are gonna maybe this is gonna take it back. But one more time, you have this, this, and this. Prioritize those building as well. Say so, ah, they took it back. Nice. Now yeah, go, go, go. Ah, go, 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 go. Ah, go, go, go. This is a good battle here. Ah, uh, they lost it, I think. Now reinforce. Try to go because you already lost it. You either open one minute rally and then you have to check which one needs reinforcement. But they took most of the buildings. Oh, this is nice. I will check here with, yeah, I will check here which one needs reinforcement because they might be hammering that building or they might be just trying to take it. So reinforce the building that you have to reinforce to make sure you take first occupation. Okay, nice. Yeah, speed up, 
Nice, that's what I like to see, good. You have to make sure to get those buildings filled quick because you don't want people solo in those buildings and then you, you're losing, of course, the building. So they took most of the building very, very nice. This guy was quick, this guy, I think this one was this one or was this one? Uh, was super, super quick, well done to that guy. Now, you, have, you wanna be in ghost rally position here. Nice, ghost rally position, that's what you wanna be. If you are not doing this in the final semi-final, you're gonna lose. Here is his, uh, his Punisher, I think the, the name. Here is just about like calling rallies and timing the goals. If you are not ghost rallies here in this Reservoir League, forget about the final semi-final because all these guys, they are sharp. They are already calling, as you can see, this guy is sharp. He was just sending troops to reinforce and then just staying in ghost rally position. Now they're gonna open, he's gonna open and they have the lead. Now. If you want to reset this position, you want to avoid being ghosted, what you want to do is to open rallies, wait for this guy to open because you're going to see people joining, and then what you do is cancel the rally and open again. So the, now you have the advantage of ghosting them and they don't ghost you. So that's super important. If you really want to win the final, this is a strategy that you have to apply because you don't want to be the alliance who is being ghosted all the time and then you don't do anything. You have to make the adjustments. You called, wait for them to call, then you cancel and then call again and then you have the advantage of costing them because of course they might not adjust as you adjust but if you are here just like i call i let them call i didn't cancel then you take the bill and they're gonna take you back so if they don't do that you're gonna realize okay so they're my calling soon let's see now they open he's gonna open of course and maybe they have another player even opening another rally let's see if they cancel no they didn't cancel i would have canceled here and open again now you are gonna see if he time it well or if it's like strong enough, they are gonna just take it back. Or if you don't wanna do that, ooh, this building who is here. Or if you don't wanna do that, then you simply have uh, another guy just opening a rally, okay? If you don't wanna like say just cancel, then just have a guy opening a rally 10 seconds later. So if you take the building, then the other one hit and then the other one take the building out. So. Here, they lost it, Ghost is coming, they say he took it back, so there you go. And then, here, what they have to do is they, they here, he, he stay in self-rally position again, you know? They took it, he put himself in rally position, he's gonna ghost them again. So, if they don't make the adjustments of calling and resetting, it is gonna be like this all the time, and they're gonna just occupy the building most of the time. There you go, they're gonna open on him, he's gonna open again. So, this guy is sharp, this guy Punisher, we're playing very well. Nice, there you go, another rally going. As you can see here, Reservoir League is not about attacking players. I actually don't recommend you here like, go attack players. Occupy buildings, reinforce playing if you need reinforcement, and then use the other marshes to ghost and to reinforce the building after you hit them, okay? And then if you have a spare marsh when the water uh, tanks open, then you get the water tanks. But you see, these are playing super well, and you already see which one has the better strategy, because if they're not adjusting, resetting the rally, now they're having trouble. Now, the, the adjustment that they make now here is that someone opens another rally. So this one is gonna hit, his one is gonna hit, and then he's gonna hit, and then he might take the building back. But I recommend you to go to, to play tricks. Cancel the rally, make them lose the goals, and then, of course, you are gonna just have the advantage to take the building. So this one is gonna take, he's gonna hit. There might be another rally coming. This guy opened late. Yeah, this guy opens late. Now they're gonna reinforce. He, if he's not, he's not beating this guy in his stats, then of course they. Oh, if they're, yeah, they, uh, he he lost the rally. You see, so the 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 because this guy, I'm sorry, they're ranting a lot, guys. But because this guy, he's beating them in his stats because he's just kicking him out straight away with one rally. This one should be the one, you know, just canceling and then hitting after the ghost. This guy cannot take them back. These are these guys here are sharp. They are sharp here and they are just like reinforcing quick and they're playing super good. So this alliance has no chance already. There you go. Now he's opening, but he's not strong enough or he's not timing the rally well. If he times me well, but I think I think he timing the game a little bit late. So this building is gonna get filled. And and yeah. And it, it's not about timing because when this guy is when he's is hitting, for example, with uh, he's gonna stay in rally position. There you go, he's doing very well. There you go, rally position, taking the building back. He's late. He's late. And you have to understand that if you are taking this building, you are low in troop because you see these players are late reinforcing. So you are like saying taking the building, 
you are low with 400 tro troops left. You get a reinforcement, 600, 600,000 troops left. This one is a full rally. This full rally you're just getting like now 1 million troops left. And this one, which is not as strong as this one, cannot kick him out. Even if it's a full rally, but it doesn't seem to be that strong. So now he opens. There you go. Bones back. Nice. Ah, he made a mistake. I think that. Ah, no. He opened already. There you go. You see? They are not making the adjustments. They are losing them because of that. These guys are sharp. These guys are very, very sharp with the ghost, especially this rally leader. He's playing very, very well. That's what I want to see in a rally leader. Just be sharp with the ghost. Don't miss the ghost. Then here you go. Taking it. Rally position. Take. Ah, oh, he lost it now. Oh, what happened? Ah, the rally wasn't full. You see, these little mistakes, guys. If you don't feel a rally, if you make a mistake like this, and now they're going to take the building and now you have to restart the strategy because now it was working well. It was ghost hitting, boom. Hitting, ghost, boom. Hitting, ghost. Now you have to start all over again. It's not about rally leaders, it's about joiners as well. You have to join those rallies. So, the rally wasn't full. Don't worry. So, you have to call one minute. Don't worry about the, the reports. The rally wasn't full. So, call one minute rally and then restart again. You know the strategy. So, one minute rally before hitting rally position and that's it okay so make sure people are joining okay yeah that's good right on the on the chat okay remember to join i don't think they're joining check the rally you know that this alliance is organized when they're not even checking the rallies because most of the time if you know that your alliance is lacking you're like oh my god i have to be checking because they're not joining but this guy i haven't seen him checking a rally not even the report so apparently they're do doing well well not now now nah, it wasn't full again you see, you see the one mistake. You don't feel the rally. Now they cannot take the building. Of course, they are winning. They are overpowered in this alliance. But when when there is a close match, this can be the, 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 the decision between, or this can be the small mistake, which is going to make you lose the, the battle. Okay. So that's why you have to be sharp with this, the joiners and the rally leaders. If you like, for example, fail to call a ghost to put yourself in rally position, if you fail to join rallies, then or if you fail as well because it's not about the joiners if you fail to reinforce your players and they're getting a smack and you fail to reinforce them, and they cannot join rallies and the rally is not full then it's your fault not the joiners players so you also have to take into account that now they seem to be getting a little bit of buildings they got center uh, okay here we go let's say if the rally is full now he's saying now uh, he's sending an, an extra march it's, uh, the, the rally is not getting full. And I think these guys now, they're, do you see? They're using all, all the formation here. But I think this monk was beating him in stats the whole time. I have to see the report. Hundred, yeah, the monk is stronger. There you go, 120, because he was kicking him out just with one rally. He was always stronger in stats. You might, what are you doing? Ah, uh, uh, yeah, they're, Look at, they're overpowering the Lions. It's, it's not bad what they're doing because they're freely winning, but I wouldn't do that. I would just like get into the momentum that I had. Because uh, you see here, he can just smack that player easily. Easily he can he can do it, but I would actually just have him doing what he was doing before. Now he got a little bit frustrated. He got like, oh, you know, yeah, we are winning. I don't, they are not coming back, definitely. I don't think they are coming back. But I will just secure because you never know. I will just secure the win. But you see, you find a lot of weak targets. So here, a lot of weak targets. But usually in older stage, you don't find a lot of weak targets like this. You usually find a lot of people with 8 million, 6 million troops. And here they are making a mistake not reinforcing because, one more time, he's just smacking players, they are not reinforcing. Now it's going to be easier for him to take the building. So here you go. I think he's gonna just keep smacking. After this, he should pour back and just open one minute rally to take that building. But you see now he's reinforcing. Ah, no, he's, he was late with the reinforcement. Uh, yeah, that's what you have to do. You have to reinforce your players because you don't want to be the guy who is here. Oh, join rallies, join rallies and your players are burning. So you don't want to do that. So reinforce your players and then, of course, you can ask him to join rallies. Uh, one minute rally. Now, 
because I have these weak targets now. You see, because I have these weak targets now, I will just bother them. I know they are weak, they are not reinforcing. I will just like, uh, before this rally hit, I will just say one solo marches, solo marches, solo marches. So they port, now he's gonna take the building for sure. See, rally's coming, I will bother this player again. Yeah, I think this building might not be full, let's see. Ah, he lost it. Oh no, he took it, there you go. Okay, now you get the momentum again. So there you go. He's gonna ghost them. They don't make the adjustments. Uh, yeah, there you go. It's gonna yeah check the report. I will. I would like to see the report. That uh, my, that uh, that building might 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 have not be fooled because he was just putting the planes around. Now he's going. He's going back to what he was doing before. Reinforce buildings uh, and just sustain what he was holding before which is super good. I, I would have loved to see him doing that. Now, the smashing player wasn't that bad, but one more time, you are just rolling the dice. Here, you find a lot of weak targets, and because you have an advantage, it's not a big deal. But if you were like in a close match, doing that is just a no-no. Here, uh, your, your rally, yeah, your ghost rally must be coming. What happened with the ghost? They are not feeling the, the, the rallies. What happened with the... There is something, you see, guys, this is just a clear example. Why you have to be on point. If you lose the momentum, is mine this happened with two buildings. Imagine that the, fight, the battle is close and this happened with like, let's say, water treatment one and water treatment two. Then you lose the battle because they haven't been able to, to come back from the, the building when they lost it. They have been taking most of the building most of the time. So. And now he's getting frustrated, you know, he's just stacking people, he's writing in the chat. So just call your one minute rally, take the building and make sure players are joining, okay? So now, I don't think he's gonna take it because this guy is beating him in stats. So they might be able, they might have, send multiple marches. I will send multiple marches after the rally. Send multiple marches after the rally. Ah, come on. You are now you not know, putting yourself in ghost position. You see? Ah, come on. No. What are you doing? I think he's uh, maybe he's gone. Yeah. You see, small mistakes, guys. Small mistake can cost you the win. So you have to be on point, joining. And especially just ghost when you're feeling those ghosts. If you don't join and, and you don't you are not on point, then it's gonna take take you time. So here, let's try again. I would like to see the other reports because if you cannot take in with a full rally, then you have to double rally. And he's making a mistake of not sending multiple marches. You should be sending multiple marches after this rally so that you can actually just say uh, kick out the remaining troops that they are there they are there. So rally is full, okay. Multiple marches. He's not sending multiple marches. He should be sending multiple marches. Okay, he took it. Reinforcements. Nobody reinforcing. And the, the, that's the other thing. Ah, you lost the ghost. What are you doing? Now he's playing super bad. He lost the ghost. Ah, uh, he lost the goals. And these people are not reinforcing quick. And these players, they are super bad already because they should be ghosting him. They should be just be... This guy should be ghosting him back. And he's not even ghosting. So, this player is not good. Ah, uh, he lost the goals and this player is not ghosting. Uh, this is an easy win for them. Ah, uh, he's being reinforced now. Let's see. Come on, check those reports for me. Yeah, you are late. Let's see. I, I think that you are late. Yeah, you are reinforcing quick. Ah, oh, you lost the other building. Yeah, yeah you lost the ghost. Now you lost it. You see, one, <laughs> seriously, I cannot emphasize this enough. Just cost you one mistake to just lose the building, like to lose the building just once, and then you cannot take it back for a while. Uh, okay. Alexi. 
Nice. Center. Okay, let's see. I don't think it's gonna take it. No. Yeah. You have to. The, the battle is close. You have to send troops after. Well, now they are doubling. Wow. I just thought they are, of course, winning. They are, they are just winning and they are probably gonna win. But um, but I'm just like uh, excited that this match plays out like this because it teaches you exactly how a little mistake can just screw the wall fight. So, because now they are accumulating most of the water in this building. They haven't been able to recover from the, 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 the non field ghost that they didn't feel before. So here they took it, okay, stay there, don't go to check tanks and stuff. Okay, nice. Now they, let's see if they build the momentum because now they time it well. And now there are two goals going. So don't worry about tanks. Apparently they are doing well. If you are seeing the score here, 6,000 against 1,000, don't even worry about tanks. I wouldn't be checking the map at all. I would just concentrate on holding my buildings, okay? So let's go. Uh, rally position, make sure that you are in self. Yeah, nice. Ghost is there. Yeah, they, they got the momentum. It took them, he took them like 20, 15 minutes to get to this, okay? There you go. Uh, he was too early. Yeah, no, he opened that. They opened already. Yeah, I'm. Uh, it's good. It's good. It's good. If it's a close fight, I will be gathering as well. But because it's not that close, I will be just focusing my march on on getting this. But it's good that he's practicing because that's what you should be doing in the Reservoir League. In the Reservoir League final, you should be doing this. There you go. Rally's coming. They, they got the momentum. You see, it took them 15 minutes, almost 20 minutes to get to this point. So make sure you feel your rally. Make sure you don't make mistakes. And they don't seem to be making the adjustments. The other team is like... Uh, these guys are molesting the other alliance. The other alliance, they have no chance. Now, you have to give it to this player. We was super, super quick, but that's the only thing he got going for him because for the rest, he's just like a lot of resources. That's the other thing, like, and this is a clear example. If you're not a smart player, you waste resources because you are just speeding up people, taking the building back, but you are not even ghosting them. You should be here just like resetting them. Here, ah, he was early with the ghost, yeah. Was he early with the ghost? Yeah, he was early with the ghost. Yeah. Another mistake. Another mistake. Uh, they are reinforcing quick. Forget about the tanks. Forget about the tanks. You have nothing to do with tanks. You are winning. Just focus on the tank, okay? Just focus on your building. You are waiting for the other player to call or what? What are you waiting for? Mm, I don't know what he's waiting for. Mm, yeah, okay, he was waiting for the other one to call. Uh, should you be going? I don't think so. You should be... Leave those tanks alone. There's no point on speed. You are still winning. Uh, we just focus on your building. Uh, nice. Oh, there you go. Let's smash. Smash, smash, smash. Rally position. Nice. Ah, oh, you didn't take it. You didn't take it. Forget about the tanks. It's, oh my god, this guy keeps checking tanks. You are 4,000. No. And now he's just like, eff it. I think he's like, eff it. I'm just gonna go and, and board these guys here. Ah, yeah, there you go. With that monkey, he's gonna smack this player. This player is not strong enough to hold those stacks. He can actually see this player. Go, keep going. Keep going. This building is... You know that the things are bad when you have a building like this alone. You are either losing a lot or you are winning a lot. It depends on the Lions. In this case, they don't even care anymore because they are losing and they know they are going to lose. And the other Lions, they don't care because they know they are winning. So, yeah. This guy is gathering... I don't know. I, I wouldn't do this. I would be focusing on, on my buildings. They took the building back finally. I think the other alliance is giving up already. <laughs> they are giving up. Yeah, they are definitely giving up. 
I keep hammering this play. This play is just sending. Nice. There you go. He's just about to die. Keep hammering that player. Uh, if you move, I don't know. If you move, I gonna we are gonna have a problem. The next hit is gonna be two hundred thousand injured. Two hundred thousand wounded. Come on. Ah, oh, he got reinforced. No, he just got his main march home. Yeah, go, go to find. Ah, go bananas. I will go bananas. Tom, two hundred fifty thousand. Ah, uh, he's sending his march out. Let's see. Ooh, go, go. He's gonna get me. Yeah. Two more, two more, and he's done. Two more, and he's done. Ah, one more. Oh my god. He's done. Keep hammering then. Yeah, send. Go. Go. Ah, no, he's good. Come on, keep hammering that player now. Don't leave. Don't leave without zero him, please. Ah, uh, he's just gonna solo buildings. Yeah, he can actually do whatever he wants now. Whatever he does now, it doesn't bear anything on where the result from the... Yeah, uh, they can just collect those little wire. Forget about that. I wouldn't even wasting a march collecting that, so... He just with one hit, solo the building. And the other alliance is already giving up. The other alliance is already giving up. They are giving up. They are just like... Mm. Yeah, there you go, you see? Uh, solo this one as well. You can solo that one as well. Actually, that the, the rally leader ported. Go there. Go there and solo that one. Yeah, just leave that one alone. It doesn't matter. It really doesn't matter what you're doing. It's 8,000 against 3,000. So, pfft. come on, guys. Let's see if you can. He doesn't have the Aurora. So, attack the P10. Attack the P10 because he doesn't have the Aurora. Yeah, he doesn't have... Ah, oh, he went... Oh, I will smack the shite out of that Piten because he's running away. He's just scared. Don't waste resources. At this point, why are you waiting resources, guys? Seriously, I don't understand. Don't waste resources. You're already winning. Save that for the final. Yeah, you might have a lot of money, I know. But don't waste... I hate that when people are wasting extra resources. No need to speed up the tanks. No need to be porting around unless you have a lot of relocators. Seems to be to have a lot of relocators. Just smack those players. Don't attack the tanks anymore. Just smack the players. <laughs> attack the players, please. Yeah, go. Go, I think that play is gonna run. There you go. Check the report. Check the report. Oh my god, check the report. Go, keep hammering. Yeah, he's zero. Go for the other one. Attack the other, yeah, the other one. Say, oh no, I'm gonna go. I'm gonna get out of here. Yeah, attack that one. Doesn't have that one. Doesn't have the, the Aurora either. Just go. Connor knows what's up. Connor knows what's up. He's attacking him. There you see. Connor got it now. Now you're gonna attack him. Oh my god, seriously. Come on, guys. Don't worry about tanks. 11,000 against 1,000. Wow. These guys are violating the, <laughs> the other alliance. These are potential winners for the Reservoir final. These are potential winners for the, If you are molesting the... If you are in the semi-final and you are with this age, either the other alliance is super bad or you are super good. And based on what I see in the beginning, they seem to be super good. Uh, because he was timing the ghost well. He was ghosting it super well. Uh, he got a little bit desperate and frustrated, but uh, overall it was good. Have to improve quickness for the next one because the other one was quicker and this one was a little bit slow but for the rest super good so here you go take back the building there are buildings getting reinforced now oh my god yeah smack the place go bananas go forget about buildings now go banana come on guys go banana there you go go to a place where you have a lot of players ah, seriously. That's the problem that I have with the spenders. If they win, they just want to rub it on your face that they are winning. So they don't want to let you get any points. If they are winning, they want to get the win, like just humiliating you by not letting you get any points. No point on that. Don't waste resources. Port to a place with a lot of players and smack the shit out of those players. So five minutes. Go for rank now. Go for rank. He's still going. You see, he's just like bullying them at this point with the tanks. 
Forget about the tanks. Let them do what they're gonna do, and you just go and smack them. Yeah, they are just giving up. They gave up like 20 minutes ago. Ooh, you couldn't beat that player. Your ego is now hurt. So you are gonna port there, and you're gonna you're gonna take it, or you're gonna port to the building and trying to smack the players. Let's see what's gonna do. Let's see what he's gonna do. Come on, guys. Still spending resources on that. Nah. No, 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 no. Uh, the guy is gonna finish now. Oh my god. Now, go bananas. Why are you it's still got it? Yeah, he's gone. Of course, he's not gonna be fighting for tanks. 9,000 again. Wow, this is. This looks like a, like a, I don't know, like a one of the beginning match. This doesn't look like a semi-final because this is a mismatch, although it is not a mismatch, but mismatch in the skills. Yeah, keep hammering that one. He's still, oh, come on, just stay here and hammer that one. You're going to burn it. Six marches, doesn't matter. Yeah, go. Don't even check reports. Go, go for the last minutes. You are gonna get him eventually. Go. Yeah, nice. Go. Keep going. Keep going. Keep going. Ah, he left. Why are you leaving just one minute before? Ah, he hammered. Ah, I forgot about the building. Come on, guys. There you go. Hammer that player. Hammer. Yeah. Ah, why, why are you running, wasting relocators? 30 seconds. Happens to me all the time. So they won. Big shout out to them, guys. So yeah, big big shout out to them. I'm gonna react to this one maybe to this from Waco. So yeah, of Cardini. Uh, I don't know. Wow, this one is a new one. I'm gonna see what I'm gonna react to. I hope you enjoy, guys. See you next time.